Greetings and welcome everyone to the world of Nia Tama Tower Zone 1.1a and last episode was so great. I really loved how they showed A2 in her Berserker mode and how strong she is. Also in this episode we got to see that what happened with 9s and how red girls are corrupting him. Now many people think that he is just obsessed with 2b and uh, how things are going on and these are his true desires but i want to say just look at the anime carefully and see what's actually happening in this scene ninas was corrupted by red girls i mean first of all they reversed hacked him and then they were corrupting his memories and then he was corrupted like you can say like at this moment red girls are literally corrupting him because you see in the details of this scene that how red girls are showing him the old memories of his past selves and they are literally uh, brainwashing him just like they did with the red virus i mean the logic virus is actually what uh, is like working here this is my theory because uh, in the past few episodes like in for episode number 14 and episode number 15 we saw that uh, when people are corrupted they just became obsessed with their loved one loved ones like you can see that uh, every time the your members got uh, corrupted and their feelings become completely dark and desiry and uh, this is exactly happening with nana so i am not just saying that uh, you are wrong that nana is obsessed with uh, and all things are happening but the reason is that he is becoming something like this just because red girls are messing with him and uh, this is exactly what they did with a2 i mean they showed her all the reality and everything and obviously it was heartbroken for these characters and they are literally suffering with these things also in the scene when nanas found the truth about black box and how they are actually created from machine life forms and they are equal he just refused the idea i mean he just refused the truth but it is not like he is completely blind i mean when a2 was told that their black boxes are actually to dismantle them and red girls who are messing with her also then she also reacted like no it cannot be possible and this is the general reaction they are giving it's not like they're denying they know the truth obviously it's a mental breakdown and people will react like that so it's not like he's completely blind and not to accepting the truth red girls are the one to get credit for every bad thing happening right now and uh, everything that every character is suffering like uh, you know what's going to happen with pascal in the next episode and we don't want to see it because it's so heartbreaking i hope that in the end a2 finally destroys the i mean the machine server and completely ends are uh, these red girls they really need to go and uh, i just uh, hope that uh, we get something very great from the end i mean for after the end uh, because only four episodes are left uh, and i'm so hyped for these four episodes i believe that some extreme thing will happen and uh, we don't know what will happen with the last uh, recovery unit because uh, 210 was the one to fight nanas in the last recovery unit and that's uh, so interesting to see what they are planning for it i think that maybe they will just uh, use that uh, fight uh, sequence where nanas fights all the a uh, number of uh, 2b units uh, in that scene maybe they will use that part because it is also so much a uh, powerful scene that uh, they can use to break down nanas more and more because uh, you can see red girls are literally doing it and corrupting nanas it's not like his feelings are obsessed and uh, like uh, he is not uh, in completely love with 2b and these are his true desires red girls are corrupting him and it is a fact don't think like 2b and nanas don't love each other i mean their love is eternal more than just love they are not just lovers they are world to each other if you know their story from the memory cage from the orchestra from the novel and obviously from near reincarnation then you know how much they love each other they literally will die if other person is dead i mean 2b and nanas literally committed suicide in the story in the near automata timeline because they don't want they didn't want to live without uh, each other i mean they cannot just literally live without each other nanas is not blind to anything or like nanas is refusing the truth about machine and androids and nanas knows everything he knows that tobi was infected but obviously only bad things can enter his mind because red girls are now corrupting him even in the game there are many moments after tobi's death that show that how much nanas loved her and how much he is sad because of her death and even a2 knows all these things and that's why she was never angry with nanas because she knows how much they loved each other and how much heartbreaking it is for them to live without each other and that's why she saved nanas in the end in the game you know the story and all and that's all i wanted to say thank you for listening to me guys and joining me in this video i always love talking about neo automata replicant dragon guard the side novels the stage plays or the orchestra i love everything i love yugotaro and his creations and even in the anime because the anime is so much detailed and well made with so many things that will explain more about these characters and depth of the story like to be nana's name was written on the beach lord as a lover umbrella pascal and children's talking about the fear and commander with futsuwa and yusuwa the first operators of the yorha a2 with port 042 and obviously red girls infecting to be that is these are some details that explains much about the story and uh, i want to share them with you 
and that's why I'm having some delays with money or Tamita episode videos because uh, these are not the only things I do. If you see my channel, I did so many things for Alita Battle Angel. Nia and Alita are my two fandoms that I love so much. I do any kind of fan activities and make any kind of fan videos. And because I really love these characters. So thank you for hearing me guys and joining me in this video. I will see you in another Nia, Tamita or maybe an Alita Battle Angel video. And until then, farewell.